good day everyone you're welcome back to my channel what i have today is how to make this beautiful design it's a very nice one and simple to make and it's unique all you need to do is to watch this tutorial to the end and uh, if you have not subscribed my channel subscribe my channel and put on your notification bell so that you can get notified each time i release a new video if you like my video please don't hesitate to click on the liking button to appreciate my work thanks for watching this is the foundation on which we shall be inserting our pattern so right now i'm going to chain three one two three so i haven't changed that three i turn it like so double crochet double crochet two three four So right now I'm going to chain three. One, two, three. Haven't chained three. I'm going to skip three at the base. One, two, three. So I'm inserting in the fourth loop with double crochet. So right now I'm going to chain two. One, two. Now I want to use this to form a triangular shape at the middle point. So I'm inserting in that same loop with double crochet. So I'm going to chain another three. One, two, three. So I will skip three again and insert into the fourth loop. One, two, three, four. with double crochet so i will chain two is a repeated process one two so i form another triangle at that point and you see i insert into that same loop with double crochet and you see so i'm going to chain three again one two three so i skip three i insert into the fourth loop with double crochet so i'm going to repeat this process till i get to almost the end of this um, round so it's going to be an interval of triangle in between till i get to the end it's a repeated process like i said so i proceed i chain two again to form another triangle one two so i insert into that same loop with double crochet can you see then i chain three one two three so i skip three i insert into the fourth loop with double crochet So this is how we are going to repeat it till we get to almost the end of this round. As you can see, we have completed this round. Can you see? So, so right now, the the one at the at the edge, I made double crochet the way I started from the beginning. Can you see? So that is what I use to end the, the this round. So right now I'm going to chain. We are going to proceed to the second round. I chain three. One, two, three. I haven't chained three. I turn it like so. With double crochet.
so right now i've completed this so i'm going to chain another three this is one two three double crochet so i insert into this uh, triangular loop here so in this triangular loop here i'm going to make five or six double crochet in that loop so i'll be making five or six double crochet in that loop that's one so two right now double crochet two then three three I proceed four in that same loop four then five five then six so six so I have six double crochet in this triangular loop so right now i'm going to proceed so i proceed so i'm going to make another six in this the next triangular loop okay till we get to the end have another one so one two six double crochet in this triangular loop as we did in the first place so three three four till we get to the sixth four five five then six so this is how we are going to proceed this round till we get to the end of it so i will be making six double crochet in each of these triangular loop here till we get to the end well as you can see we have almost got to the end of this round can you see so right now I'm going to chain three at this point. I chain three, one, two, three. I haven't chained this three, so I'm going to insert into this first point here with double crochet. After which, I proceed with normal double crochet without skipping the loop. So proceed without skipping the loops till i finally get to the end of this round double crochet so we have got to the end of this round can you see so nice and beautiful so we are going to uh, proceed so i will be chaining another two then three one two three then i turn it over so i'm going to proceed with double crochet proceed with double crochet so like i said earlier i said this pattern is a repeated uh, process so that is that what makes it simple to make so it's not complicated it's just a repeated um, form
so double crochet so right now I'm going to chain another three one two three I haven't chained this three so I'm going to look for the midpoint remember we made I made six double crochet in this triangular uh, loop so I will look for the midpoint so the midpoint is here here so I'm going to make double crochet right there I haven't made that double crochet so I'm I will chain two one two so I insert into that same loop there with double crochet so I'm going to chain three now to continue one two three so I insert into the next one the midpoint of the triangular okay with double crochet this is the midpoint with double crochet so I'm going to chain two to form another triangular shape there one two so I insert into that same loop to form another triangular shape can you see so it's a repeated process so i'll be repeating it till i get to the end so i chain three right now one two three so haven't changed this three i'm going to look for the midpoint of this so this is how we are going to go till we get to the end of this um, round double crochet then I form another triangle one two chains then inside that same loop with double crochet So this is how we are going to go till we get to the end you see, of this round. So as you can see, I've completed this round. So right now, what I did in the midpoint here is what I shall be repeating in this next round. So right now, I'm going to chain three. One, two, three haven't chained three then I turn it then I continue double crochet double crochet so I proceed like that double crochet so right now I'm going to chain three no I won't chain three sorry I yarn it over so I'm going to make six double crochet in this loop so we proceed one two three four
5 then 5 sorry we are on the sixth one 6 can you see so this is how we are going to continue like so you can see exactly what we did here is what i'm repeating here so that is how we are going to go repeatedly till we get to the end of this round so i will make another six here another six here till we get to the end so we have come to the end of this tutorial can you see so beautiful pattern you can use it to make anything you want very nice and beautiful so thanks for watching this tutorial till we meet again bye for now